little update to the one and a quarter inch plumbing overflow uh, capability. I've been adding water. I'll pour a couple gallons in, pumps up top, this level drops, pour a couple more in, and each time it uh, is settling out at its happy medium. But can the one and a quarter inch flow 655 gallons an hour? I say no, because the weir is swamped. Let me quiet this thing down, man. Yeah. Something wrong with me. Well, it won't focus. Anyway, same style silencers I had before. Focus, idiot camera. Ah, that's better. Anyway, water is riding up on those slots. Now it's about half an inch, five eighths of an inch up from the bottom of the slots. So that weir, well, it's not the weir, it's the overflow. Barely capable, not even really. It took a lot of it. It took excess head pressure to get the water pushed through the one and a quarter inch tubing. That's a better way of saying it. There's been some question regarding weirs about water stagnation in the weir. With a really big weir, yeah, I, I would think it would stagnate. But with this little three and a half, three inch uh, PVC weir, no water is stagnating in there. You've got vort vortices. <laughs> You've got vortex that'll come and go. And man, if I drop something down in that weir, it's gone. It's down into the bottom filter. Lickety split. So anyway, can 655 gallons an hour flow through a one and a quarter inch Schedule 40 PVC? Durso overflow. Nay, I say not. 